hi everyone welcome to my channel this video is about again the pressure cooker this time I'm going to be showing you how to make lamb uh, lamb handi so the thing is the, the way I'm making it is completely different not everyone will probably uh, want to make it like this some of you might just want to use a pressure cooker and make the full uh, lamb masala in there but I prefer just to use a pressure cooker just for um, the lamb so they get soft and then I used a separate um, saucepan and in there I made the rest of the masala so as you can see here uh, I've washed lamb and I've um, these small pieces and I'm gonna fry it first inside the pressure cooker once it's fried then I'm gonna set it up uh, as pressure cooking for 25 minutes so here as you can see I did some oil and I put some salt in and I'm just gonna fry it for a little bit once it gets a bit um, like a grey brownie colour so I'm gonna add in some water just enough to cover the meat up but um, I think so I did slightly again put a bit too much water in like last time when I made uh, the lentils and I did add too much water so when you're using this pressure cooker you don't really need to add much water just make sure that you just cover whatever you've got in with water don't need to put too much water in that's what I've learned so far whilst I've been using this pressure cooker so now what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on uh, start click on pressure cook then I'm going to click on time and set it up to 25 minutes so once the pressure cooker timer has finished a uh, small music sound will play and then what you need to do is take out the pressure so just be careful as you can see here i nearly got burnt with the steam This is what it looks like when I open the pressure cooker. As you can see, there's a lot of water left. That is why you don't need much water. Anyway, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to take this lamb out of the water. And um, you don't use this water when you put the lamb in the masala because it'll, it'll be like a weird smell to the handi. But it's up to you. I mean, I know there are some people who just put everything in, but I personally don't prefer to put this water in. And as you can see here, that's Look, it's actually shrunk in size as well and it has gone really soft and it saves a lot of time so here i've separated the lamb and i'm just gonna put this into the masala now can you see there it's quite nice and soft so i've added the lamb into the masala and i will put the recipe below so if you are interested in um, the full recipe it will be down below and I did leave it for a little bit, just simmer it for a little bit. But it actually did turn out really, really good and nice and soft. So there you go guys, hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any questions, just leave your comments below. Thanks for watching.